So I'm here with Carl Abbott and Paul Tomlinson following Gresley's 2-0 win over Sleaford Town. So Carl, obviously happy with the three points there. Do you think maybe you might have got away with one with their chances that they had? Maybe, but I think they got away with one with, with our chances as well. I think maybe it could have been a 6-3, mm -hmm. you know, something silly like that. Um, you know, if they're taking their chances, then I'm having us taking our chances yeah. as well, you know what <laughs> I mean, with our firepower. So, you know, we've, we've had you know, clear cut chances around the six yard box, you know, we've had our goalkeeper make a couple of good saves, uh, one that's crazy outside of the outside of the post. So yeah, yeah, fair enough. They could have got two, three goals, we could have got five, six goals. So yeah. it is what it is. Um I think that the next three games are gonna be very different challenges but but really hard, mentally difficult for us because it's it's um difficult not to have one eye on what's going on elsewhere. We know that we've come through a period of the season where we've had just hard game after hard game. Games where it's really easy to focus your mind because you know you're gonna be in one. And then I keep looking at the fixtures, and everyone around us keeps playing teams in the bottom three, bottom four, and you know piles the pressure on us in in a way. But then when the shoe's on the other foot, I know there's stuff. I know there's games going on elsewhere that are really high high stakes, and then we can't really we can't really win, can we? Because we're expected to win. Anything else is a disaster because we because we give up ground. So um, it brings a very different pressure, and. Uh, you know, I think we've 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 worked hard. We've often puffed and play very well today. The pitch is is pretty cruddy at the minute. Uh, that's not an excuse, but it does change things for us. We have to readapt a little bit. Um, and I think that with them changing their manager and bringing in some fresh blood, and they were very demanding from the sidelines. There was a lot of adrenaline. I think we probably just played the best Sleaford that there's been this season. And um, you know, that brings a different challenge as well. So. Um, just, just please, really, just to just to chalk another one off. Really, I think that there was only one outcome that was satisfactory today, and that's three points. And uh, however it's come, you know, we'll we'll take that and and uh, move on to the next one. The team's re played really well in his absence, but Morris is back. He came off the bench today. How close is he to starting? He's ready now. So that you, you know, you just wanted to be fair to the lads from last week, and obviously having to put Reedy back at right back as well. You didn't want to make too many changes in the back four in one in one game, but. Alex is back now, so that's it. So from next week, he's he's back in, in the side, and and you can see by coming on as well, he he settles things he settles things right down for us, and and uh, yeah, so he's he's fully fit now, 100% fit. He trained really well on Tuesday night, so yeah, from now on, he's he's back in the side. Obviously, in the last couple of games, we've had a, quite a few chances on the break that we've um, could have put the game to bed, but squandered them. Um, is it important that we're scoring goals from set pieces now, whilst we're struggling to put the ball in the back of the net from the counter attacks? It's important to put the goal from wherever they come. But yeah, I've been impressed with this this year. To be fair, I feel last you know that last year, the few games last year, we've seen a struggle on set pieces. And this year now, I don't know how many goals that is from set pieces. You know, we look a threat, don't we? You know, and and that's nice to have that because it it gives teams something else to think about. You know, we're we're a big unit. And, uh, and yeah, so it's really important to take your goals and chances from wherever. But set pieces are really important, certainly in, in, in the game this day and age. But for me, I want to flip that round because if you are if you have got games where you where you're, you're struggling to score goals, but you can keep a clean sheet, and, yeah. we, and we look solid. I know they've had a couple of chances, and I mean the one for Fenny, I think he's more like a match of the day save. I think you know he, he looked a good save, but. I, I, two bounces and he tipped it around the post so for me I mean that was just a, an half hearted chance and they've had one more opportunity we've had four or five second half inside the six yard box that we should be bursting the net with but saying all that another clean sheet Yeah, another and clean sheet and it's the FA Vars next week how excited are you to get back into that competition yeah really excited you know it's um, you take it it's, it's another game that you know is, is really important to us obviously you know we've talked about this before the club has a little bit of history and hasn't maybe done so well in the last few years, so we want to try and go later rounds. Um, it's a, it's a, it's a, you know, it's, it's not an easy draw. I know that much. I know a little bit about Harrowby, a couple of players they've got. Danny Dirk, you know, I've tried to sign in the past the forward. Um, he's a very good player. Um, so it's not going to be easy by any means. We can see our pitch is not the easiest to play on anymore. So we need to have a little think about our own approach now, um, and, and and adapt suitably accordingly. Um, we are. Obviously, Monday's come off today with a knock, and uh, obviously Moza's Moza's going back to getting back to full health. But then Fraser was struggling a little bit with a, a little bit of a niggle, and and uh, Reedy was feeling his groin. So we'll have to see how we are in the week, um, and, and make some decisions around the side from there. So it's it's going to be a tough game. Take it very very seriously. Yeah. Want to progress? Want to be in that draw on Monday afternoon, <laughs> and. Uh, Keep, just just keep the momentum with the club. The gate's up again today a little bit. Really, really, really want to push that 400 mark 
you know, I'll be really excited when we do push that 400 mark and to do that, we've got to stay in the Vars and we've got to stay where we are in the league. Um, you know, we're probably going to drop off the top over the next week and a half, two weeks, even if we, even, you know, we need today because of the games in hand situation. Well, we just got to keep plugging away and make sure we're, uh, make sure we're still in and around it at Christmas and then kick off. All right, cheers, guys. Cheers.